Hey guys, anybody help here? Welcome back to the channel. Now today I wanted to share with you guys how to get this amazing customized lock screen on your iPhone. As you can see right here, I have a beautiful weather with a greeting and the daily forecast. I have additional extensions or shortcuts here at the bottom, such as battery percentage. And I also have right here my calendar, of course, the camera and the flash. And I can also update this wallpaper, change it and change also and update these elements as I plug my iPhone into charge, which I'll show you how to do that here as well now it takes about i want to say 15 seconds or so as the shortcut this is going to be a shortcut runs through and it changes the wallpaper every time i plug it in it updates my battery percentage my weather forecast every time i plug in my iphone it's a super super awesome shortcut and a super awesome lock screen customization that i think you guys are going to really love and automatic change in the wallpaper is just a next level customization for the lock screen of your iphone you'll always have a new wallpaper every time you plug in and you'll always have the latest weather forecast as well as well as any additional shortcuts down here will be updated as you can see here in just a few seconds this will automatically change after i plug it in to the power source let me show you that here in just a few seconds it should happen here momentarily and you will see a new wallpaper just like so now of course as always if you would like to stay up to date with the latest ios news and apple software updates don't forget to subscribe and make sure you turn on those notifications so that you don't miss another episode now let me show you how to do this the first thing you need is to head on over to the app store and download the shortcuts application if you don't have it already then you want to click the links in the description and it'll bring you here this is glance glance the shortcut it is currently in beta now i've shared this before but now it has additional features for additional shortcuts as you can see right there at the bottom of the screen i have my battery percentage and my calendar something that wasn't there before and i recommend you join their discord which will be right here you can join click on there and they will offer you the latest beta available at the moment it supports ios 15 15.4 i'll also link down below the glance current beta as i have it on my device right now the only issue i've noticed so far is that the wallpaper section can't be automatically changed to whatever wallpaper you want so you have to use the wallpapers integrated within the actual shortcut so once you head on over to this website here and you click on add shortcut it's going to add it to your shortcuts application now i'm not going to do that obviously i've already added the shortcuts to the shortcuts app so i'm just going to quit that operation right now and let me show you what to do after you install it now one thing to note is that you want to customize it first so for example here on the lock screen let me go ahead and plug it in so i can show you how that changes in a few seconds here on the lock screen here you see that i have a good morning greeting with the words i device help i have the weather i have different complications one on the left the one on the right next to the flash and next to the camera i'm going to show you how to customize all that using the actual extension shortcut here in your shortcuts application now once it changes you'll see here as i mentioned before you'll see that everything will be updated once again now take a look here at the weather take a look at the battery how everything will be updated if there's any changes everything will be updated after i plug it into the power source here just like so now let me head on over to the shortcut and show you how to customize it to your liking so click on the three dots after installing the shortcut and the first thing you'll get greeted with is a username so if you have wallpapers to automatic you can leave it at that you can tap into username here and type in your name so when you get the greeting it's your name instead of the word human i believe is the word that they're using for the standard uh, greeting then you want to scroll down and you find your left complication now i currently have the battery percentage set for the left complication right there it is but you can also set any of these other options like rain you also have the next alarm and things like that so if i change that to rain right after we unplug and plug again you'll see that that will change we also have the right complication which at this time i currently have the calendar right there it is so i have my next calendar event i can change that to the temperature if i wish to do so just like so and you'll see that all these changes will happen after i'm done plugging in and plugging back into the power source and now let's go ahead and close out of this now that we made those changes and we're going to go to the lock screen here and plug it in and just wait about 15 seconds again every time you plug in this will update and just like that as you can see it has changed the complications to the ones that i've set it to and you can change these as you wish so now let me go ahead and show you how you can get it to change when you plug it in to a power source now before we continue guys i wanted to share a quick word from our sponsor this is the power source that we use around the studio this is the u green nexo 100 watt power delivery charger it is portable 
it is sleek it is fast it has four ports this is a four in one we have three usb c's and one usb a you can charge an iphone 13 with this from zero to 60 in 30 minutes even my macbook pro 16 inch will charge from zero to 100 an hour and a half it is insane it is fast reliable portable with the new gain chip inside this is three times faster than the standard charger that comes with the iphone or used to come with the iphone so this is going to be the power source that i use in order to plug in my iphone and let me show you let me show you how you can customize your iphone by plugging it in to a power source like the U Green and nexo 100 power charge station as you can see right here links will be down below in the description make sure you guys check it out there's also a discount code which you can get an extra 35 percent off so now would be the time to grab the U Green 100 watt power charging station. Links will be in the description down below, of course. So how does this work? I'm gonna go ahead and plug it into a power source and it changes my wallpaper and every other change that I make into this shortcut. So let me show you. What you wanna do is you wanna go into the shortcuts app. Then you wanna head on over into automations. Under automation, all you have to do is click on the plus icon here, create a personal automation, and then you wanna scroll down until you find charger right there. So when it is connected to a charging station, Going to click next for that then you want to go ahead and search for run so run and then it will give you the option to run shortcut then you want to tap into the shortcut option and select glance go ahead and select glance then click next and now ask before running needs to be turned off and now every time i plug in my iphone to a power source then it will actually change the wallpaper. It will change everything just like so, as I mentioned before. It is as simple as that to actually get it to automatically update your actual lock screen with the latest weather, the latest information for your shortcuts and the extensions right there on the bottom portion of your screen. Thank you for watching today's video, guys. I hope you guys enjoy this one again. Links will be in the description down below for everything. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.